Hey guys, Britta here. Welcome to another Brick in the Mall. Now, this is a game I played back in ooh, 2017. Bloody long time ago. I thought I'd bring it to the channel, give you guys a first look, see if you guys are interested in seeing a bit of it on the channel or not. It's a game that I love playing back in the day and endless possibilities. Nobody will design the same thing as the next person. Everyone designs something different. It's a pretty cool game. Um, I don't know if we go... Sandbox, scenario, um, I don't know, like, mild shoplifting, I don't know what the lobbying cost cap is, maintenance costs, margins, I don't know, standard demand, I want to go random demand, random prices, and have it so it changes a little bit, I guess, uh, frequency, not so frequent, like we don't want it looking like a heartbeat, but... Um, start with 200k, um, normal research, mild rat infestations, staff hunger and bladder needs, I don't really know much about that. Um, we want shoplifting, we want standard random events, and lobbying cost cap, I don't know what that is. Not quite sure. I'll go unlimited, just because I'm not sure what it is. Uh, margins... I don't know what margins are either. Interest rates, minimum salary, maintenance costs, road work costs. Yeah, we want everything sort of standard. I don't know if you guys let me know what you think about these settings, whether they're worthwhile or not. Let's go in, let's get started. Um, oh no, actually, let's go back to main menu. Uh, yep, because I think I did. I don't want the bloody tutorial. Yeah, I don't want a tutorial. I know what I'm bloody doing. That's all the same stuff. Yep, let's go. Let's start. Alright, so pause straight away. So, we start off here um, as a little spot. I want to... We're going to build a massive road around to link out yeah, to over there. So, I want to put in a shopping centre, like a grocery store straight away. It's going to cost me quite a bit of cash. Um, foundations... Okay, I want to remove that road. Let me build a road down. I want to remove this one. Um, and I want to do custom parking all the way along here, but that's going to take a bit of time. So I want to remove that road. That's the main thing for now. I want to go one, two, three. I want to go maybe 50. Ooh, maybe not. Let's go a 30. I was going to go like a 30 by 30, but god, that's expensive. Alright, we'll do that for now. Alright, let's get the speed up, so that way yeah, you can remove that road where you just parked. I don't know how you're going to get out, but good luck to you. I want to build a road up here. Um, I want to put in... We need like a storage spot in here. One, two, three, four, five. So maybe here we'll put in... Storage spot. We want to put in a... Um, Staff door there and a staff door there. Doesn't cost much to go through the bloody money either. Um, this road, I want to put in like a loading zone. Two loading zones. I want to go with a garbage pickup and I want to go with some staff only parking down here as well. But we're going to need a staff door here and here so that way the loading zone they can get straight in and out as they need to. Uh, big double doors. I think maybe there. There. I want to put customer parking all the way along the front. Um, sales opportunities. No parking. Yeah, well, we're not even open yet, so I don't know what you're whinging about. Manage maintenance center. We need to look at our staff. We've got some builders. I want to just change them back. Start at midnight. I want one to start at 8 a.m. Eight hour shifts. Let's go hire a builder. You. Where's the one we just hired? There we go. There. And we're going to do eight hour shift. Hire builder. I don't want to close that. Set starting hour. Uh, what's eight? So go four o'clock. 
you and you, yep. And then they should be... Everyone should be eight hours. Someone wasn't. There we go. That's seven hours. Want to go? Everyone at eight. Right, perfect. It's going to cost us a little bit of money, but right, manage. I should build castle parking all the way along the front, except for one spot, because I want to put a bus stop in there once we have it available. And castle parking all the way along here as well. So that's four. Let's go across to there and then we'll maybe put like a road down this way and then up there. I think we'll, we'll add that as customer parking too. Alright, so the shop's done. Let's slow things down. Alright, so we want to go with the store. We actually probably need to assign, assign the store like that and then we can go storage. Build, check out counter. See, so yeah, I want to make sure we've got a heap of counters down the front here. I'm right, just sort of having a bit of a look. So I want to go the food shelf. I want a shelf there and I want a double shelf. And a gap, double shelf, gap, double shelf. Well, that worked out perfect. You would think I planned that, but no, no, I didn't. Right, and then do we... No, I want to maybe just go... All the way along. To there, I guess. Perfect. Check out counter. So now we're going to have to, obviously, leave a bit of a gap. So there, and we'll go to there. So we can bring the shelf shelves down as well if needed, but I think that might be enough to start with. I want to leave this spot over here for maybe some refrigerated, some refrigerated over here. So it's going to be sort of a slow start, I guess. Just need to wait for our builders to finish doing the roads, the grocery store, the grocery store, I should say, is what we want. Fifty percent of food. Or more. They want a vape shop and also a uh, fast food restaurant. Alright, I want these guys to focus on the store, but they're going to get the bloody parking done first. Is there a pain? Right, actually, build. We need to go all, and we want to go staff only parking there as well. Actually, no, get rid of that, because we could probably go with a road. And we can put some more staff parking down through here. Alright, there we go. They're going to start working on these shelves. Alright, so if we go assign products, food, uh, food shelf. So we've got 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Alright, let me just go, I'll double everything. Two of everything in. Oop, no, that's not what I wanted. Candies. Canned food. Coffee and tea. Uh, cookies. Pet food. Rice and pasta. Sauces, sliced bread, and some snacks. I think if I go all, yeah, then we can do um, some soda. Let's go, like, say, three soda and three bottled water at the back and some juices. I'm a bit worried that if we do too much, we'll lose the food. Let's go um, some candies along the front. We'll just random up these things. So I can change them all later as needed. Uh, pet food. Go rice, pasta, sauces, and seasoning. All right. Now um, I also need to extend this building, so let's extend that while we're here. And remove that wall, and then I want to put in, yeah, a staff door. 
should say in there because then I need to put in um, some researchers as well. Alright, so now if we come out of that, we can manage our store. Store name. We'll just call it the groceries. Who cares? Um, we can't really change our opening hours too much. 18 hours, link storage to there. So we're going to go, there's 18 hour shift, 18 hours, so we're going to go maybe 9 hours. We open at what, 6? Okay, so start at 6. 1, 2, I want to go 3 cashies in the morning. If we go 9 hour shift, that gets us through to 3 o'clock. Alright, then we go hire another cashier. One, two, three, and then stock clerks. Don't know how many we're going to need. We'll just hire two. Um, all right, stock clerk, you want to do nine hours, and I want you to do nine hours too, so that way there's always someone there. The products should be getting delivered now. Which they are, perfect. Uh, build, let's go with some staff only parking. Through there, perfect. And then that road can... Three, four, five. I want to go maybe down from there to there. Um, I think a loading zone's fine. Might go with another garbage pickup. And then staff only again in there. Alright, so before we go too far, we want to throw in some trash cans. Trash cans, uh, we want to throw in some war tiles. Uh, maybe go the brick, I guess. So people have somewhere to walk. Oops, I don't want to put it there. We're going to need to get rid of um, those. But, oh no, yeah they did. Okay, I wasn't sure if they would um, do that or not. Alright, so we should be open. Um, so 10 different types, so we got that. Oh no, they're, they're new objectives. Yep, so we should be open. Just waiting for people to come in now. Customers, where's all our customers? There we go, there's one, perfect. Alright, so builders could probably reduce the builders now. Um, we're only going to need a couple. I'm going to fire the midnight ones and then I'm going to fire these other guys. Just got to throw in a quick pause, guys. Sorry about that, guys, but when the wife calls, you must answer and obey. All right. Um, so what I want to do down here, uh, we've got to go into office and put in some desks. I think three will do. Um, yeah, three will do, because I want to have some... Um, shift planning. Actually, we need to assign that to be an office. I always forget to assign things. Right, and then we can manage our office staff, um, hire office worker. I want to go midnight. We want people working all around the clock, and I want two at both times. So eight, um, and then two. Uh, I want to go with speed over anything else. All right. Um, yeah, so that way there's always people in there, and we're always researching. I want to get cold chain first I guess so we can get some more food and stuff into here if we build and go uh, store we've got the fridges there go three there do a double and a double yeah that'll work double 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 and then we'll go three I don't think I can put anything in there yet. Oop, no. Oh, there's water and stuff. I don't want water though. I want, don't want juices and stuff. Um, Alright, so we're not going to turn a profit 
for a few days until we start getting customers in. I've got enough staff parking and storage is doing okay. I want to extend back this way and get this storage room. Um, actually, let me... I think I turned... No, let me turn this up. Because I can't really hear anything. Uh, build a volume, toilet flush, car door alarm. I don't really need that. There we go. Now I can hear, hear them and I could probably turn the music down. Who cares about music? Right, now I can hear the ting ting tinging. Hopefully you guys can hear it too. Right, so research. Uh, so I'll 10 different types of products, record 5 report. Reward of five green if I can spit it out properly. So we are a grocery store as well, which is good. Um, we're nearly turning a profit. Probably will by the end of the day. Yeah, we have turned a profit. Got 20 different types, have 100 customers on site at once, which is going to be a bit hard. 100 total sales. Make 500 total sales. How are we going with research? Actually, it's 34%. It's going to take a little while, but. Right, and then daily profit over 100 bucks, 5 grand again. So, electronics and appliances store, a vape shop, fine dining. Yeah, so I want to build like a decent size grocery store and just have it separate to our mall. Maybe? I don't know. I don't really know what to do. Um, 67k. So, I said I want to expand this. We just need to get some more research done, get the cold chain stuff done. Then we can open 24 hours as well. I think I only have like one staff member in the checkouts. So we made net profit of 950 bucks yesterday. Which is good. Obviously we've got too many um, cashiers at the moment. But once word of mouth gets out there I think it'll start to go nuts. Right, let's go customer parking all the way down here and all the way down here. They could do that. Research is 94%. Alright, research menu. Um, some more frozen food. Let's go straight with frozen food. Let's slow this down. We want to go uh, fridge. So dairy. Dairy down there, we go fresh fish, fresh meats, and some milk. And then we'll probably look at um, pizzas, veggies, ice cream. I think of the next lot. Yeah, pizzas, veggie, ice cream is the next lot. So if we look at our fridge, yeah, we could probably. Oop, no, don't want that there. get all this filled up with cold. Actually, no, I don't want that either. Um, yeah, let's get rid of those because I want to put, we will get fresh fruit and veggies and stuff eventually. I think, I don't think we can Ah, oh, we do have it now already. Alright, well. Let's get those put in. Uh, fresh fruit, fresh veggies, fresh bread. Yes, we do. We have that already. Well, that would make more sense. Let's go table, fresh bread. When our builders finish doing the road, he'll come in and sort that out. We made 1700 profit. Pretty good. Another 10 grand. That's where we make all our money early on. Um, I still want to close store, comic book, and find dining restaurant. Right, I definitely want to expand. I mean, uh, it's not too bad. The grocery store at the moment. It's not like we're short on stock or anything, so. Uh, actually, before I forget, we really need to come into here and go staff, uh, janitor. We want to go 8 a.m. Lead patient, social ability, and we want to go 2. There, yeah, done. So we always have a janitor on site at all times. 
Right, and then our builder should come in at 8 a.m. I think. All right, let me move the mouse out of the way so you guys can see. So yesterday, 1700. Hopefully we get more than that today, but we'll see. All right, let's go. Fresh bread all along the front. Fresh fruits. Fresh veg. And then we'll change back to the fridge. We'll get that sorted eventually. So the more products we have, the more people are going to come in. Let's make sure it's still, still a grocery store. Food is still 87%. Now we've got queues. Look at that. Once we start missing, it'll say when we're the queues are all full. We'll start missing people. That's when we'll start to change it. Right, frozen food's done. Our logistics would be good, but we don't need that right now. Uh, chemicals, I'm not worried about that. It's more just stuff. Um, what is stuff for here? I think we'll go night hours. Now, if I look at a sign and I look at just a normal shelf... So there's a few things we could probably add to here, you know, diapers and all that sort of stuff. So that's sort of why I want to expand a little bit more um, out this way. And then we'll move, remove these shelves and put them down here. So let's look at doing that. Um, foundations. Ooh, another 20k, that's good. I want to go all the way up to here. And then go to there. Then I want to make sure we've got walls in there. Alright, and now we did unlock that as well, so let's go uh, fridge. Alright, slow down a bit more. Frozen pizzas. Frozen veggies. And then ice creams. Not sure what that fourth number is. Alright, um... Yeah, see the checkouts are already full, so now this is where we need to be like staff uh, pause. Let's go buy a cashier. We need to go 6 a.m. I guess we're going to need to go with 3 at 6, and then we want to go, was it 3 o'clock, I think? Uh, yeah, that, okay. Alright, then shift planning, so then we can extend these guys out. We look at just cashiers. I think they've all got to go to midnight. If we just extend them all out one, we're pretty much always covered. And then once we get the 24 hour thing, 92 grand, so we're definitely smashing the money out pretty quick like it's it's pretty quick so what we got here we just got soda bottled water and some juices so these will all go uh, let's go build get rid of those done all right so four missiles opportunities Right, then we'll, we need to obviously assign uh, the store, like extend this and then extend the storage when it's built. So we've got the things that come up as well. So school supplies, laptops, pants, t-shirts and dresses for school season. Um, Halloween candies and greeting cards are a huge thing during Halloween, obviously. So right now we've got six. How much money did we make yesterday? 2,800. Not too bad. Not great, but not too bad. But this is where you make your money from the objectives. Right, so once all this is done, probably we need more builders, but we're just paying them if they're just sitting around doing nothing. So I don't want to pay them if I don't have to. That's it. Let's get this store done. Thank you. No. Get this bit done. Right, thank you. Now let's slow it down again. Look at building our food shelf. So across the back again. 
then we'll assign uh, food shelf. So bottle of water. Actually, we've got, they've got to get built first. Yeah, there we go. So bottle of water, uh, juices. What was the other one? Sodas. Soda across there. Then we want to go build again. From there to there? Yeah, we'll do that. From there to there. Then we'll just extend. And then I want to make sure... Let's do that there. We want to go with just a normal shelf. Oop, no. Oop. So there, but then that one will go. So we'll adjust them as we need to. Then we need to assign uh, storage in here. So then we'll get more storage deliveries. So we got night hours done. Uh, alcohol license so we can get like a liquor store as well. Ah, uh, logistics, security, bowling, cinema, fitness, chemicals, clothing, uh, electronics. Should we go in the electronics store next? I think we will. Let's go electronics next. So these should all be different. Cookies, pet food, rice and pasta, sliced bread. Right, once all those shelves get made. Right, so what's in here? Um, diapers, toilet paper, pads and tampons and stuff here. Yeah, let's go assign just a shelf. I don't want to put too much stuff in here, but I definitely want to go with some diapers, we'll go three of those, some greeting cards, go greeting cards there and light bulbs, uh, where's our, go those there, school supplies, we want school supplies, toilet paper there, do you want some school supplies, but is there greeting cards too, not yet, alright, let's we'll go school supplies there. Alright, now let's select, so what have we got? Go breakfast, all the way down to sliced bread, snacks, canned food, okay, so assign, food shelf, the breakfast cereal, candies, pretty sure. Canned food. Coffee and tea, cookies, I think, are they juices too? Nope. So there, pet food, alright let's pause that, pet food there, rice and pasta, sauces and seasonings, sliced bread, Okay, snacks. Then we've got sodas. Let's go juices. All the way through there. All right, make sure we're still... Still the grocery store. That's good. But now we've just got extra stock. So now we need another... Like, another shop over here. Um, oop, we missed a bit. As far as customer parking goes. So do we attach it? We can attach it to this store. I don't know how much we have. So the electronics. Can we look at um, electronics and appliances all? So food shelf, shelf, fridge. So table, seven of those. Seven of those and four pallets, so we need like 11. 11 spots. So, did we make money yesterday? I didn't even look. Where's our thing? Nearly 3,000. Customer parking is slowly filling up too. Um, they're still in the electronics store. Um, I want to... Sort of look at this... So, let's leave a gap of three. 
we're going to need three per register. So four, seven, eleven. So twelve. I don't know how far to go. Maybe th yeah, we'll go maybe eleven. Registers go to there. We go all the way back. Which is what I want to do, because we need to put in a storage at the back too. So we need to wait. 11 by 29. Once a day's finished. We should have it. No, did we not make it? What do we need? 63, 8. Ah, damn it. So close. Let's just put that in. Bugger it, we'll put that in. Uh, build, we need to go all. Double door right in the... M we don't really have a centre, do we? Double door. Double door, that'll do. Trash cans. Trash cans out the front, we want to remove that. And once that's done, we'll put in another trash can. Where's our build oh, builders are up there doing their thing? Alright, so the garbage pickup's outside, yep. The janitors will come in and pick up this. I'm a bit unsure why the stop clerks don't do that. I know they're not a janitor, but still. Alright, our stock clerk's starting to struggle a little bit. We're going to need an extra stock clerk. Yeah, we're going to need two stock clerks at all times. Did we unlock the night hours? Yes, we did. Okay, we need to do that as well. Sort of get a bit confused as to what we have and haven't done. Right, those things are out of date, so they're getting replaced. Definitely need stock clerks. And then the night hours as well. Get rid of that bloody tree, would ya? I need the bin there. Thank you. Alright, now slow it down. We'll manage store. Actually, let's pause it. Um, 2400 hours. Higher cashier. We want to go from midnight till 6. We want 2. Midnight till 6. Done, and then stock clerk. Let's look at our stock clerks. Where are they? Look, they're not there yet. Um, so six. They both do nine hours. We go six a.m. or higher. One more, and then we will go three p.m. or another one. Nine hours and nine hours. Yep, perfect. Alright, now we can hopefully extend that to there and let's remove the walls there. Let's look at our. Uh, where are we at? We haven't unlocked it yet. Alright, so check out counter. One there. Slow it down again. One there, one there. And one there, or we just do it like this. Right, then a sign. So we needed um, table. Seven tables. E 30k, that's good, that's what we want. Bit of extra money. So seven tables to get everything we need in the store. One, two, three, let's go four, five, six and seven. So I want to double up. And then the pallets. I think we needed four. Yeah, pallet we need four of. So 
one, actually one, two, now we need one, two, three, four. Let's double those guys, because we're going to need a storage room up the back there. Let's not forget about that. Um, I think I want to go because you need a gap between the walls. So if I put a I put a wall here. We've only got one row of storage. Let's put it there, and then we'll go wall. We'll go with a staff door in there, in there, and we want a staff door in the center because we need to build. A road up and around with some floating zones and then garbage loading zone. I don't know if we need garbage for this side, to be honest. Um, 33k, so we're doing all right. We're making, we only made 655 yesterday, but we'll see how much we make today. Now we're running 24 hours, might be a bit better. So we want a double loading zone. Thank you. I want to get that road done, that'll be nice. Then we'll go staff only parking. There, and we want to go customer parking all the way along the front. So a couple more spots there and then one more down here so we haven't unlocked what we need to yet right so we're still here yeah, looking at electronics so we can't really that needs to be a store all right a sign let's go to store there storage this is going to be um Let's go to Eddie's Electronics. Oops. Eddie's Electronics. I want to go, say, 9 till... 9 till 9. 9 till 9 will do. See how that goes. That's, what, 12-hour shift, or we can just do 6-hour shifts. Alright, and then we need to wait for that to come through. Um, still don't want electronics and appliances. Which we'll get to there. How's this going? Doing good. 8,000, so 5,500 5, profit yesterday. Now uh, we need the bus stops unlocked. We've probably got too many cashiers now, but this place will hopefully just keep, keep booming. Uh, let's keep these builders on the go. So how many do we have there? Five, six, seven, eight, nine. So nine. Nine to there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine to there. And then we can take it up. Bring the road around. Alright, we've got some rats, which I think are taken care of already. Squalor, yeah. Well, actually, no, the rats are still there. The builders have got to take care of the rats, and they're obviously busy building right now. So yeah, we're missing out because people are seeing the rats at the front door. All right, research menu. Uh, I don't know what we need next. Logistics, chemical supply, clothing. Let's go maybe appliances. Yeah, we'll go appliances. Uh, let me go into here. Let me just can all this. Go and take care of those rats. That'll be nice. And then you can go back to doing that. Alright, so let's slow it down again. Eddie's electronics. Uh, let's look. There's nothing on the pallet yet. Alright, so we need to just go with table. So cameras, 
games consoles, laptops, MP3s, smartphones, TV sets, and tablets. Alright, and then what we were 9 till 9, yep, okay, so higher cashier. 9 a.m. Ah, oh, it's not very good. Can we hire? Will it change when we go in and out? Not really. Uh, okay, so 9. It was a 12 hour shift, so you can go 3. And like that. Stock clerk. We'll hire 2. I don't know if we're going to need 2, but 9 to 6, and then you can go 1500, 3. Done, and then hopefully when they come in in the morning, that'll open up. Let's look at our footpath. Along the front, out the front there. Um, builders will get that finished. I'm just worried about where's our uh, maintenance centre staff, janitor. So eight, you mean to be eight till two, and then we'll hire another janitor. And you can go two. Um, no, I don't want you at two o'clock. One of you needs to be midnight. So midnight to eight, and you're eight till 14, 16 is. There we go, that's why I've got it wrong. Right, so we have a gender at all times. Yeah, you know, to do the rubbish and everything, hopefully. Probably need more than one more than that many janitors anyway. Right, keep an eye on this electronic store. I think, you know, we are making a decent amount of money, so let's look at janitors. We'll go midnight. 8 and then 1600 so midnight 8 hours yep 1600 midnight 8 and then 1600s so we've got 4 at all times because obviously the stock clerks are taking the um, bread and fresh stuff that is gone alright now we need to pause this needs an extra person already so 9 till 3, cashier, you want to go at 9, then 1500, done, and 6 hours, 6 hours, yeah perfect, we're missing out Eddie's electronics just because everything is full, so hopefully once that other person comes in, there we go. We won't have as few in there. How are we going in there? Usually, I don't know, like that. Oh! Why is it not giving me the... Oh, because hasn't, we haven't gone through a day with it yet, I don't think. Oh, what's wrong with you now? Uh, queues are full at the groceries? That can't be right. We manage, look at our shift planning. Yeah, that can't be right. Can't be right. The stock's doing okay, so we don't need any more stock clerks. Yeah, I don't think this is going to be 24-hour shop. I mean, we could, but I don't think we need it. And we'll put the appliances in the middle. So an electrics and appliance store. Daily profit over 5k. Yes, what did we get? 5-3. All right. Uh, our workers are unionised. Okay, all good. So clothes, comics, fine dining. I think we're doing pretty good. We're already up to day 12. Yeah, see, this is midnight to 6. There's only a few people, so we don't have to stress about having extra store clerks just yet. But we might need some more staff parking. Because all this is nearly full, and these guys haven't even come in yet. 
Now it looks like, so the stock clerk's like, they're not going to do much, but we've already made 60% profit, which is good. 70% over here. So it's all profit. So Halloween is a current event. We've got Christmas coming up. So we've got, we need a toy store and stuff for that, but I don't know if we're going to get a toy store in time. Um, and we got 20, so this is our current car spaces, 26 of 84. Let's get that done while we're here. Give the builder something to work on. I think we're doing alright, like, our profits are going up, it should be, it should be our best day yet, I think. What I want to do is actually look at managing this uh, midnight eight and, yeah okay so higher office worker we're gonna go midnight eight and then 1600 so that way we've always got three on the go just getting our research done even quicker all right so I wonder how that went we'll see how that goes at the end of the day so 60% profit we had 70% in here Uh, 47% so not as good as the first day and 68% so not the best but yeah okay so that's a lobbying cost so every time the union gets involved maybe that's what the where the lobbying cost comes in I'm not quite sure I mean, I'm open to anything if they want more money they get more money I'm not stressing because you know we're we're making a decent amount we made 4-3 yesterday so not a huge amount but hopefully this store will continue to pick up uh, builders let's get rid of this stuff down in here when they're finished they're busy doing the roads but yeah, I'm just not sure um, don't really see how many visitors they had or how many customers they had in here I mean, we're still doing pretty good. I can't complain at all. But we'll get through one more day, then we'll call it call it quits. I think I want to do about 45 minute episodes. Um, I did put that cut in earlier, so I'm not sure. I think we're probably up to like nearly 50 minutes now. We're putting that cut in, but our profits are going up. We're already sitting at four and a half. We're gonna get to five pretty quick. We're probably over clerked down here, but. Yeah, I'm not worried. Over cashiered, I should say. 5,000 total sales, an extra 40k. This is where, like, our money comes in. Sell 40 different products, so that will be tomorrow once we get the stuff on those um, pallets. 100 customers on site, 1,000 total sales, daily profit over 10k. We're already up to 6,000. Probably got enough money to build another, another store over here what that store might be, I'm not sure. Let's look at loading zone. We'll go staff only down to here, because then if you put another store in, we'll be good. A closed store. I don't think we have clothing yet. What do we get now? Are we getting appliances? So maybe clothing after that? 48 hours, 48 man hours. So I think a clothing store next will be good. A vape shop. I mean, these are all like little tiny stores we could put inside a mall. And these these stores may... I mean, this may be the start of our mall. We put a mall, you know, around here or something. I don't know. You guys let me know what you think. But right here, guys. We'll end it here. Made 6,000 yesterday. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this first episode. Let me know if you want to see this turn into a full series or not. If you've got any ideas, suggestions, hints and tips, you guys let me know to close. Uh, if you guys are new to the channel and haven't subscribed yet, guys, please do so. It's been Bruno. Thanks for watching. We'll see you again soon.